Hi everybody, Chris back with you talking NBA. After completing a massive five-team multiplayer draft pick trade, the Washington Wizards now have their new point guard in the fold. He's former Brooklyn Nets starter Spencer Dinwiddie. He has signed a three-year extension and is ready to get started in D.C. Obviously, free agency is almost like a game of musical chairs. Um, you know, I, I think this year's market was highlighted by point guards, uh, you know, first and foremost, Kyle Lowry in terms of the unrestricted free agents that could make decisions and also highlighted by the, uh, you know, blockbuster Russell Westwood deal. So, you know, when you look at the game of musical chairs and, and then uh, possible fits, um, the Wizards really stood out. And um, it was a, a place that I wanted to go to, being familiar with, with Beal and his game, matching up, you know, both age-wise and, 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 you know, play style-wise. Uh, you know, so it, it just became a fit that, that popped on the board you know, uh, pretty recently, and, and um, I'm blessed to be able to be here. Everybody has certain, certain styles, I think, in mind. Um, in terms of playmaking, like, I, I typically am able to gash the defense before, uh, you know, kicking it out or, or throwing a lob or whatever it is. So, you know, you're able to create more calls out in that scenario, even if they don't necessarily lead to assists, you're causing havoc and you're making plays in that manner. And I'm not Gilbert, John, or Russ. Um, you know, yeah, those are... Those are all dudes with uh, uh, very interesting personalities. I mean, you know, you got some of the best players. You know, obviously, Russ, one of the best players to ever play in terms of the triple doubles. You got Gilbert, one of the best scorers of all time. You got John, who had an extended run where you could argue he was the best point guard in the league. You know, and, and so, you know, you got to always uh, respect the accomplishments of what people have done. Um, I think I'll be the first point guard in – DC history to possibly lobby senators about Bitcoin. Uh, we can go with that. Um, but but in all seriousness, I think um, just just my style of play is very different from them. Um, like I said, I respect everything that they did. Um, but you know, my what I want to be known for is winning, um, and, and that's what I hope to bring to the franchise. Like at the end of the day, just you know, whatever it kind of takes. So I think my career kind of kind of shows that. Shep from from the beginning of the meeting talked about how much he believed in me, which you know, meant a ton, you know, mm -hmm. like in my basketball career. Um, it sounds kind of cliche, but like all, all I really wanted was to feel love. You know what I mean? Like mm -hmm. I, I bounced around and, and had, you know, hardships here and there and everywhere. And, you know, all you want to do is, is, is feel a little bit of love and, and go out there and, and put it all on the line for the, for the people that support you. And we will have more with the Wizards as they continue to play in the Vegas Summer League and as they prepare for the upcoming season.